everybody. It's a really exciting day here in the studio. I have a brand new Scut kiln. And in these boxes, we have new controllers for my clamshell kilns. I'm really excited about doing this upgrade to my kiln so I'll be able to fire them more quickly, more easily, and have be in constant contact and kind of know what's going on in those kilns. I have these or monitor them from my phone. Really exciting stuff. Go. Oh, I got it nicely packed in foam. Ooh, check that out, right? Is this exciting? Ooh, that looks fun. That part looks a little scary, but this part looks really fun. Don't worry about installing your new controller. SCUT makes it easy. They have a step-by-step -step instruction manual with lots of pictures and easy to follow videos on their website. One of my favorite features of the touchscreen controller is the Kiln Link app. Kiln Link works in conjunction with Wi-Fi and allows me to monitor my kiln temperature and status from my smartphone anytime from anywhere. Changing the controller is easy. Go to SCUT's website and download and print the touchscreen controller upgrade manual. The next step is to turn your kiln's circuit breaker to the off position. Then remove the old touchpad and disconnect the wires from the old touchpad. Following the instructions in the upgrade manual, install the wires on the new touchscreen controller. Mount the new controller on the box, turn the power on, and let the creating begin. Let's check out some of the features of this touchscreen controller. I've got these directions here, which I plan to read cover to cover. Luckily, it's not that many pages. But in the interim, of course, like everybody else, you get a new toy, you want to start pushing buttons. So it says begin here, so let's begin here. Okay, so it's got a program, settings, advanced setting, diagnostic, and logs. Let's see what programs does. There we go. It has a guided start. It has glass fire. Let's do glass fire. Let's get right to the meat of it. And it's asking me what COE I'm going to use, what process I want, the speed, the temperature it's going to go to. I can, it has a hold time. So let's see. Let's go here and just look at the COE. Oh, look, I can pick different COEs. How cool is that? So I'm going to be working with 96, so I'll save that. And then it's asking me what process I want. Look at all these different options. I can slump, tack fuse, contour, full fuse, cast. Let's just push slump for fun. And it's asking me what speed I want to use. Slow, medium, or fast. Oh, let's go medium. And then it's going to go up to a temperature of 1220. Shows me that right here. And it has a hold time of five minutes. I usually like to hold my stuff 10 minutes. So let's go ahead and adjust that. Oh, so now I've got a hold of 10. I have an alarm at 9999. There's no delay. Look at that, I can set a delay if I wanted it to start. Let's say I wanted to start in uh, five hours. It'll start in five hours. And the estimated time is seven hours and 11 minutes. That is really cool. And then we can view the program. Look at that, we can check it out. Look how it's gonna fire at 500 degrees an hour to 250, hold for 12. It's got this terrific eight segment program in there. And up at 1220, we're gonna hold there for 10 minutes. That's our target temperature. Oh, look, we have a graph we can look at. Fun, right? This is a cool thing, man. I can tell I'm gonna have a lot of fun with this. And I'm gonna go back. Uh, Another terrific feature of this controller is I can install my own firing programs. I select the Write New Program option and then give the program a name. I'll use this Full Fuse Small program to fire projects that are 12 inches in size or smaller. Then I save the program and follow the prompts to add the different segments. The first bit of information is the rate of increase for segment one. Then I add the target temperature. Then I enter how long I want to hold at that temperature. Adding segments is as easy as the push of a button. 
After entering the desired number of segments, then I save the program. After saving the program, I can recall it, view it, and make changes at any time. I love the touchscreen controller's large display screen and easy to navigate prompts. This program will be complete with four segments, but the controller can hold up to eight segments on every program. After saving the program, you can view the key information. I can also review the segments to ensure that I entered all the information correctly. When I start the kiln, a graph appears on the screen. The graph is a great visual that shows the current stage of the firing process. From here, I can also view the estimated time remaining for the firing. With the Kiln Link app, I can monitor my kiln temperature and status from my smartphone. The touch screen controller's large display screen makes it easy to monitor the kiln from anywhere in my studio. As the temperature increases, I can monitor the firing process on my phone. The green line on the graph shows the current stage of the firing. At this point, I can press the details button to get more information. I can view the current segment, temperature, target temperature, and the remaining hold time. This is great information for calculating production time and cost on my commission work. The fun, color-coded display makes at-a-glance monitoring easy. When the kiln's firing, the Kiln Link app is orange. When the firing is complete, it turns green. A flashing blue dot indicates that the firing is complete and the kiln will soon be cool enough to open. The touch screen controller and Kiln Link app have impressive functionality. The wide range of options gives me creative flexibility as well as the confidence to try new advanced techniques. There was no downtime. Integrating the controller into my working studio and active teaching facility was seamless. The touchscreen controller and the Kiln Link app are the ultimate kiln upgrades. With these innovative tools, I have infinite control and limitless possibilities at my fingertips. Right out of the box, I was able to get started firing with the easy to navigate guided start firing programs. Then for more options, I was able to add my own custom programs. Now I have everything I need to fire simple projects and complex projects all in one convenient place. Accessing saved programs is quick and easy. The ease of use and functionality is amazing. With these innovative tools, anything is possible. The user-friendly display screen, along with the Kiln Link app, give me features I didn't know I needed, but am thrilled to have at my fingertips. I feel like updating my firing process has given me renewed artistic freedom. Now I can focus my attention on creating exciting new original art. The Kiln Link app gives me fast, real-time updates so I can stay connected to the firing as it happens. When the kiln reaches the target temperature, new options appear on the screen. I can add time, add temperature, or anneal now depending upon the desired results that I want to achieve. The touchscreen controller is responsive and easy to navigate. With the numerous innovative features of this new and improved controller, anything is possible. Let the creativity begin. Happy fusing!